If you work in the QS profession, are a project manager, administrator, engineer or designer, chances are you have come across CMAR at some stage, whether that be to manage an entire framework contract or simply on a one-off basis for an individual scheme. This video is going to briefly explain what CMAR is, how it can help on a project and also some of the frustrations that a lot of people who use it can have. Before we explore in more detail, please subscribe to our channel. We release brand new content every single week. CMAR stands for Contract Event Management and Reporting and is a dedicated contract management software specifically designed to improve contract management and administrative demands on construction projects that use an NEC or FIDIC contract. It has been ISO 27001 and 9001 accredited and is arguably the most popular choice of clients who wish to administer an NEC type contract. It has been designed to be able to manage the entire contract lifecycle from quoting for new projects to agreeing a final account and all of the ups and downs in between. To gain a better understanding of the CMAR software, we are going to take a look at some of the benefits and drawbacks. Benefits Organisation CMAR allows users to create, store and manage contracts in a centralised platform. This streamlines the contract administration process and ensures that all stakeholders have access to the latest contract information instantly. Document control. The software facilitates document control by providing a secure and organized repository for project related documents. This allows for efficient document collaboration, version control and document tracking throughout the project lifecycle. It also saves on the pain of trying to send large files over email. Collaboration and communication is greatly improved if used correctly. CMA enables effective collaboration and communication between the different project teams and organisations at all levels. It provides a platform for stakeholders to exchange information, raise queries and manage responses. This fosters transparency and reduces misunderstandings and facilitates timely decision making. Risk management. CMA can help to identify, track and manage risks throughout the project. It allows users to log and monitor risks, assign responsibilities, set mitigation strategies and track their progress. Being proactive to risk management is one of NEC's core ideals and CMA supports this approach. Reporting and analytics. The software offers robust reporting and analytical capabilities allowing users to generate real-time reports on various project parameters, enabling informed decision-making. Potential drawbacks of CMAR The learning curve. Just like any software, CMAR has a learning curve associated with its implementation. Training and time will likely be required to become proficient in using the platform effectively. Cost CMAR is a commercial software product and its usage involves licensing and subscription fees. For smaller construction projects or organisations with limited budgets, the cost of implementing and maintaining CMAR may be a constraint. Dependency on internet connectivity. CMAR is a cloud-based platform, which means that users need to have a stable internet connection to access and use the software. In locations with unreliable or limited internet access, this dependency on connectivity can pose challenges. And finally, although not a drawback specifically towards CMAR, and like any new software system, the effectiveness and worth is only as good as the data and information uploaded. Buy-in and proper use from the supply chain, and equally the employer's staff, is essential to getting the most out of the software. Matrone, a commercial hub to your business.